What's good, YouTube? It's your main man, Cardorm, and I'm back with another video. And today, I'll be making an infinite runner in Godot. So make sure you all like and subscribe. I'm trying to have 500 subscribers, so your subscription is much appreciated. And with all that being said, let's get right into the video. <laughs> Alright, so the first thing I did was set up my player scene. I set it up using the Area 2D node, then attaching a sprite to it, and also a collision shape. I used the sprite frames and then got the Angry Runner from Open Game Art. I'll leave that in the description. So now I began the setup for my main scene. All I needed for now was my platforms to keep spawning and for the instance my main character. Now I was gonna set up the script for my player, and this is where things get complicated. I wanted my player to jump so it could hop from platform to platform, but I don't think I can make it jump using the Area 2D node. I can make it move automatically, but for some reason, it just won't jump. Come on, just jump, man. But as a quick little fix, I do have something in mind. And it doesn't involve me redoing all my code. So this is what I'm working with, a runner who runs but doesn't jump. Uh, okay, gotta fix this. All right, so this is the finished project. Now I have a runner who runs and jumps. I had to move this whole thing over to Godot 3, and I'd say it turned out pretty good. Instead of having my character run, I did it how I did in my Flappy video and had the platforms move towards the character. I had to add some extra lines of code, but I think it was worth it. And hey, look, I even added a background. So yeah, that'll be all for today's video. Make sure you all like and subscribe. Have a great rest of your day, and I'm out of here.